Lex Fitness just sitting here in a sauna. Whoa. Just sitting here in the sauna. You can see that. Bit of a 360 there. Let's get it put down. Lex Fitness. Lex Fitness from UK. Now, this is not a hate video. Just share my comments and criticisms. Right? So I don't hate this uh, this fake Natty Lex guy. Uh, he does a muscle up, though. So hats off to, for him to show on how piss weak he is at a muscle up. I'll get back to some muscle up chance later on. But it's good he's having a go. But my grief is with Lex. Let's get into it. Let's have a look at his muscle up. So, Lex says that vegans are weak and pathetic and they can't do shit. Even on steroids, this guy can't even do a prop and a good muscle up with good form. He eventually, after a while, he does a half up, half, so it's more of a kip than a true muscle up. So, perhaps off him for having a try and having a go. But even there you go, just non functional steroid muscle. <laughs> now, <laughs> I'm not saying this guy's on steroids, but he says inspire. Lex. If you really want to inspire the teenagers who make up the majority of your audience, I want you to submit to a carbon isolate ratio testosterone test to show us all that kids out there can actually build your physique without anabolic steroids. You claim to have never used them. Correct me if I'm wrong. Now, if you have used them or not, it doesn't make you a bad person, but the fact that you say, desire, inspire, achieve, all you do, all you achieve is taking money off kids who think they can get your physique natty. And your desire is just for money and fame. So you're not lying in that aspect. And that's just my opinion. My opinion is you would never, ever pass a carbon isotope ratio testosterone test. You would never, ever pass a long-term metabolites anabolic steroid test. In my opinion, prove me wrong. Prove me wrong. Get a cycling license. Contact Cycling UK, uh, UK Cycling. Contact UK Anti-Doping and say, hey, I want to be tested every motherfucking month because there's this... Skinny, 147-pound vegan marathoner in Australia, actually Los Angeles now, who says I'm on the gas and I want to prove him wrong. And they will test you. They will test you every month for anabolics, for the whole whole host of gear. So if you want to claim that you can get these results, look at the look at the variation in physique. This, my friends, is called cycling on and off. That's all it is. But uh, most dumb fucks out there can't see that. But Lex, I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. I want you to prove me wrong. I want you to inspire people by showing us we can get at full natty bra. And I want you to submit to the carbon isotope ratio test. I want you to contact UK Anti-Doping and register up and show us all that you are full natty bra. A vegan diet you can't perform. Let's check out this guy, Andrew Frewer. At the time of this video, he was actually doing a fruitarian diet. Fruitarian diet. People say, he looks skinny. This motherfucker ain't on steroids. And check out his bodily function, man. His performance is off the motherfucking charts. Do you want to look like a puffed up steroid head in the gym who can't even do a fucking proper muscle up but walks around like I'm a big tough strong guy? Or do you want to be like, have some body function and not fuck your heart up by the time you're 35? Check out Andrew Frewer, the fruitarian at the time of this recording. This is a motherfucking muscle up. This is like a muscle up into a handstand. How the fuck does that work? How does that work? This motherfucker is full natty bra. This shit is inspiring because this shit you can actually achieve without doping, without drugs. You can motherfucking do it. So if you want some role models, have some full natty bra role models.